Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a week or so ago, I posted that you could now choose the time before a tab is discarded in Chrome Canary. So if we just head to the experimental flags page and we type in memory saver, configure discard time bef uh, for memory saver. This controls the time before memory saver disc discards a tab. And as I mentioned in that video, which I'll leave a link to in the description, uh, that tab could be discarded to help save memory f um, from one minute right through to 12 hours, depending on which um, uh, which you actually selected for that experimental flag. Now, um, it seems that once again in Chrome Canary, uh, Google is still working upon uh, the memory saver feature where you can discard that tab. And... Uh, um, if we just head over to a screenshot, because I haven't received this feature yet, but this has been provided by Leo over on Reddit. Yeah, we can see that currently in Chrome Canary, um, the favicon, basically the little icon uh, for the tab that's been discarded, um, for inactive tabs that are discarded, it now fades to let you know that the tab has been discarded, which is very similar to the sleeping tabs and the dimming tabs. Um, that we get over in Microsoft Edge, which is part of the efficiency mode sleeping tab. So once again, um, it seems that Google is intent to follow suit and is bringing a very similar feature now and is testing a very similar feature now in Chrome Canary, as mentioned, that the favicon for those inactive tabs that are, that are discarded now fades to let you know that that tab has been discarded, which I actually think will be a nice move because it just indicates that that is a discarded tab and is saving system resources. And then just something else, uh, just for the purpose of today's video, just to mention this quickly, um, if we head to the settings in Chrome Canary, another change that Google has recently made and is starting to work on, um, which I haven't received yet once again, but nonetheless, just to give us a general idea, and this was also spotted by Leo um, over on Reddit, um, if we head to the privacy guard um, and we go through these steps, currently we have uh, choose your search and browsing quality. Then we have choose whether to sync history, uh, choose your safe browsing protection and um, choose your third party cookie preferences. Now this privacy guard I have posted on previously, but nonetheless, um, it seems now that Google is starting to test and has added in Chrome Canary a new auto verify page, which will be part of of this privacy guard now in Chrome settings um, that the Chromium dev developers apparently are calling um, anti-abuse. So basically um, this apparently was added for testing in Chrome Canary back in February but uh, um, I haven't received it yet in my region but nonetheless that's just another change we uh, could be getting where Chrome Google is working on a new option um, that will prevent annoying captures, as an example, from appearing on most sites, which they are calling anti-abuse. So that's going to be an interesting one to watch. So just those two changes, that um, anti-abuse setting coming to the privacy uh, section of Google Chrome, and also those favicons, which now dim, just to indicate that that tab is indeed now being discarded after the preset time that you have selected. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.